Libra, welcome to my channel. I have messages for you. These messages may resonate. They may not. Take what fit. Leave what doesn't. Welcome, welcome, welcome to all my newcomers, my new subscribers. Welcome. I have messages for you today. This can resonate at any time. This message could be timeless. Whenever you clicked on this video, if you clicked on this video, Libra, you were supposed to hear this message, okay? So, um, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on so you will not miss any of my videos. Um, Spirit God's answers is in my highest good. Allow me to connect with the sign of Libra for these messages here. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node. Okay, Libra. Protect me as I go into this energy. Anybody sending any negative energy is returned to sender, so it may be. Libra, somebody doesn't know how to feel about you. I did pull some messages from, what is this? The Hidden Truth, Volume 1 and 2. And I did the Shadows. What's this? Yeah, in the Shadows Oracle Cards. And I mixed my decks all together, uh, these decks. I mixed them all together, and I just separate them. And then I pull some from out of one deck, and then I pull some from the other deck, which I need to know. Okay, Libra, are y'all having chest pains or like what's going on? Or somebody around you could be having chest pains. Okay, I'm feeling like, um, yeah, chest pains here on the right side. So maybe do y'all need to go and get a mammogram? Is this time for a mammogram checkup or something like that? But I'm feeling like, um, yeah, I'm gonna just drink some water. Somebody could be in pain about you. Whoever this is, this person wants to make amends with you, Libra, but they are in a committed relationship. They saying, you could be telling this person that they don't know what they want. It's like they're saying, I don't know what you want. You possibly told this person, like, I don't know what you want. Like, you keep doing stuff and it's just weird because someone keeps wearing a mask here. Libra, okay, this individual could be going through some sort of like divine intervention, which which is causing them to see life differently now, okay, within a relationship, their partnerships, or whoever this is, okay, but they're saying, I wonder if you are happy without me, so this individual wants to know if you are happy without them, even though they are in a committed relationship, I feel like this person thinks about you, I'm just reading the cards. I'm just telling y'all what's coming out, okay? And that's just what it is. Somebody is wearing a mask within a relationship, but I feel like divine intervention is at play because this is the second card, okay? Um, catalyst, supernatural serendipity here. I feel like what you see here, this could be a fire or something is being like, this is like a tower moment here, a sudden change, okay? I feel like there's, there's two people here on this car and they're watching shit go down, okay? So I feel like someone wanted to like blow up something for you, but this kind of like backfired onto them, okay? Yeah, someone wanted to see something blow up in your face here, but you see how this their shit is blowing up here on this divine intervention due to somebody having a hidden motive, wearing a mask, Okay, this is a stink bomb. Y'all know them stink bombs. Somebody didn't want you to see something here. They were trying to like mask something, cover something up. They didn't want you to see. Maybe they didn't want you to see that they was in a relationship with someone else. Or they were hiding the fact that they were in a relationship with someone else. They didn't think that you knew. Yeah, can I? Huh? So yeah, but with the high priestess... You know this whole time. This could be why you ghosted this person. Or this could be why the, when this person wanted to come back towards you. Because there's two people here on this five of pentacles. There's two people here in, in poverty. One person is walking away. And the other person is like, but wait, I need you. You see what I'm saying? So maybe this is why 
you left or you stopped dealing with this person or maybe why you you ghosted them i feel like you can know that somebody is sick here as well or somebody could be struggling or they could be going through a divorce a breakup or whatever wow we got the king of cups and then we got the tower wow somebody's going through it here or this is like an outburst in emotions like someone's feelings just changed drastically here that's what i'm seeing somebody's feelings just change like just drastically like you know what i really don't like you like that i thought i did i thought i was in love with you but i'm not how stupid of me wow let's see this is for my libras we got the two of pentacles in reverse so for some of you somebody is lacking some kind of balance here okay this is someone that was biting off more than they could chew here with the two of pentacles in reverse yeah this is someone that jumped into something they thought this was going to be a good idea but this is like a poor financial decision that someone made here okay somebody did something here yeah three of cups all right this could have been like a friend or maybe this person was a friend with benefits yeah seven of pentacles in reverse so we got the seven of pentacles in reverse. This is like a, a bad business decision here. The pentacles is in reverse, child. This is someone that reunited with someone. Maybe somebody reconciled here or somebody like decided to up and get married. And they just like, damn, what did I do? Or somebody decided to jump in a commitment like fast with someone. And they're like, shit. Okay. Also, this could be this person not wanting to finish what they started here. Garden. Say it like that. A scissor. What's the two of pentacles? In reverse. At that. Two of pentacles in reverse for Libra. Yeah, Ten of Wands. Somebody got themselves in a stressful situation here. I feel like there could be someone here that could be telling someone something here. This could be a Libra, a, a Gemini, Aquarius. I was going to say, yeah, Taurus, Cancer, or a Capricorn. Wow, there's another card behind the deck. Wow, so we got the Ten of Wands, and then we got the Empress and the Queen of Swords. Wow, so someone could be, like, pregnant, and they could be telling somebody that they're pregnant. Or this is a mother figure here that could be like, ugh. I'm seeing a mother figure here that could be burdened and stressed out. Or this is a pregnancy, okay? Or somebody stressed about the mother of their kids. They're like, man, I don't know what the hell I did by having a baby by your ass. I don't know what I did by getting you pregnant. Well, why did I do this? Somebody could also be a single parent here. They could they could be saying a lot. If this is you, I don't know, Libra. If, is this you? Are you stressed out? It's like, are you having trouble like communicating something with someone? But the two of wands, what's the ten of wands? Somebody's moving here. Or somebody's saying, I'm not moving shit. Somebody decided to make a poor investment. What's the Ten of Wands, Empress, Queen of Cup, uh, Swords? Yeah, Four of Cups. Somebody didn't want something anyway. That's what I'm seeing. They're like, man, I didn't want this opportunity anyway. What you mean? Like, I, I didn't want this anyway. I don't know, Libra. Is this you? The Empress and the Queen of Swords is you. Maybe somebody tried to come towards you with some burdens and lack and, and stress. And you just like, man, I, I didn't want this burden. This isn't, this isn't what I wanted. That's your energy coming out, the Empress and the Queen of Swords. Maybe this may be another Libra that I'm picking up on. I don't know. But somebody was refusing the offer here with the Four of Cups. They said, I don't want it. Nah. Maybe somebody frustrates you and they piss you off. Or somebody was hiding the fact that they got somebody pregnant. So this could be another Libra that's pregnant. And somebody was hiding, hiding it from you that they got somebody pregnant. Now they're going through karma. Mm -hmm. Yeah, baby. And they saying, well, I didn't even want this baby. So I'm picking up. Okay, what's this Three of Cups here, please? The Three of Cups is intimidated by your beauty, and then we got the devil. 
So somebody is infatuated. I'm seeing TNT in here. Somebody is infatuated with you, but yet they're intimidated by you here. I'm pulling the devil card. Okay. Okay, so this could be a Capricorn, a Cancer. Yeah, I'm seeing com competition, jealousy here with the Five of Wands. So, okay, so I'm hearing a dog, but that dog sound kind of vicious. Yeah, so somebody like barking. They, they, I mean, not necessarily like somebody's like talking. They, they just talking so much. Like they got so much to say possibly about you because they're going through karma but i feel like whoever this is this could be somebody having a hard pregnancy or they're burdened with a pregnancy and it's like they didn't even want this baby so it's like they could be telling someone this who is this queen of swords talking to them? because this is someone that knows exactly what they want Okay, and maybe somebody could be telling someone like, no, I know what I want. I don't want to keep this child. Like, I just don't want it. Like, so I feel like there could be a lot of conflict, group conflict too as well with the Three of Pentacles, Five of Wands. Okay, so what is this Queen of Swords saying? Okay, so they wanted to come out. Okay, so the Six of Wands. So this is someone that's at a disadvantage here with the six of wands here. They fell from grace. Okay. Or, or this is something that you could be saying that's making a lot of people want to come towards you and hunt you down or, or whatever with the six of wands. So it's like Libra, if this is you, like if you're speaking out or the queen of swords could be a public speaker here, but I'm seeing like, yeah, there's a lot of jealousy too. I look at the six of wands in reverse. I did see the five of wands too as well. But I'm seeing like somebody's falling from grace. Or somebody has to accept defeat. And that's just what it is. Could be a, a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius. We got the Eight of Swords, the Nine of Wands. This, this uh, Eight of Pentacles. I mean, Eight of Wands. Not Eight of Pentacles. And then the Magician. So... What's the intimidated devil and three of cups, please? We got the king of cups. 1244 on the clock. That's huh, that's the time my daughter was born. So, yeah, you could be dealing with the Pisces. My daughter's a Pisces. She was born at 1244. So, yeah, this is a Pisces or somebody has Piscean in their chart. And it's like they could be intimidated by your knowledge they can be intimate, but this person seems like, but it seems like this person is in love with you. Yeah, they're in love with the work that you do, but then, but then yet they're intimidated by you. Give me intimidated, devil, three of cups, please. Yeah, five of swords, envious, jealousy here, bullies, intimidation. Somebody wanted to intimidate you because you're getting a victory here. Okay, while they're going through karma. Yeah, while they're going through karma with the judgments. Okay, so this could be somebody that wants to. I feel like somebody wants to like, it's like you intimidate somebody so much to the point where they want to resort to violence. Yeah. And so, so, so somebody want to do some fuck shit. Yeah, what's the five of swords? We got the star. Yeah, they're mad because you're a star. You're chosen. You're a star seed. You're a healer. You're in the spotlight. You just, you, yeah. Yep. You're inspiring. That's what it is. It's just a bunch of a hateful ass people here that's mad because they spell work didn't work. Okay, so now people are losing out and yet they are still intimidated by you. Maybe if y'all stop doing this fuck shit, then shit wouldn't happen to you here. I'm getting the type of people that like to go and do underhanded stuff behind the scenes. And then they get mad when it doesn't work on you. When I shuffled the deck, the high priestess was on the bottom of the deck. So that let me know, Libra, you knew everything that was going on behind the scenes. And motherfuckers are mad because you're so protected here. They want to take their little miserable ass lives out on you because you're the one that's protected. They're mad because they're losing in life. And this is a catalyst for them to stop doing this weak ass shit. I just can't, I just can't picture like what makes a person 
want to go and dabble in spell work to ruin somebody else. What, what, what makes you want to do that? You bitches. What makes y'all want to do that? Because that's just ridiculous at this point. You sound pathetic. Like you're just a waste of human fucking flesh. That, to me, that's what it's, it, it, you are. Somebody's mad because your wishes are being mad. You get exactly what you want. You're the star. Hello? You're the biggest star. You that big one right there in the middle. You're all the stars. But you that big one right there. You that big one right there. So now they're losing out. The two of pentacles in reverse, bad investments. The seven of pentacles in reverse, bad financial, poor financial investment. Pentacles is all about what you can taste, touch, or feel. People lose. And seven of pentacles in reverse. And that's the truth. Ace of swords. Yep. Yep. They got clarity that they're losing. Yep. They have clarity that they're losing. They're like, aha, I got it. I'm losing in life because I keep doing spell work. On Libra, and for some of you, this could be another Libra that's doing this. This is another Libra that's pregnant. They're having a hard pregnancy. Um, they don't want this child here with the Four of Cups. They're bored. They're just sitting around, not doing nothing. Don't want nothing out of life here. They refuse offers. They took a fall from grace. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing. Yep. Mm hmm. Ace of Swords. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The nine of wands. Truth is, they was in and out and they was a player. They was promiscuous. If you wanted to know if this individual was up to my male Libras, if you wanted to know um, if this feminine was promiscuous, she is. She is, okay? Could be dealing with a Sagittarius or somebody has gotten a truth about a Sagittarius being promiscuous, Okay? Somebody makes quick decisions here. They jump into shit very quick, but they jump right into a bad investment. Like, I just can't, like, Nine of Wands, Ace of Swords. Yeah, we got the Nine of Wands, and then they get scared, and they get irritated and frustrated. Like, damn, what did I do? What did I just do? Yep, Ten of Swords, because there's an ending. Somebody was sneaky. They were lying here about a family, or somebody went towards a family. Okay, a Ten of Cups that they've been hiding or betraying somebody with this whole time. They went right towards that family. Hmm. Somebody did something. Okay. Somebody made a decision. They thought they had clarity in this. This was a new idea. They said, this is going to bring me abundance. This is going to bring me success. But this come, and they went, they had force going through this. They were thinking clearly about this poor investment they were thinking so clearly about it they're like yeah i'm gonna go and do that now the nine of wands is here now they're tired because they're like damn what did i do i ain't got no bag i ain't got nobody they hurt bruised what's the nine of wands nine of wands child queen of cups for some of you this mother figure keep hurting this person they keep hurting this person Somebody keep getting hurt by this Queen of Cups, man. This Cancer Scorpio Pisces or whoever this Queen of Cups is, they keep getting hurt by whoever this person is. They keep being bruised by this person that's in this player energy, okay? With the Knight of Wands, somebody keeps getting hurt. They keep getting dogged out, even though they have clarity about this person being a bad investment. Give me this Queen of Cups. We got the Knight of Swords. For some of you, this person crazy as hell. Yep. So somebody's crazy here. They have a record. They're a follower. But they come off very like, um, I'm getting I'm getting this person takes care of their children. Nah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna hate. This person does take care of their children. They could be a loving mother to their children. Okay, very empathetic. They may have an interest in a in, in a cult or something like that. Um, but this person crazy. This person's nutty, man. Something something about this Queen of Cups just don't sit right with me. 
And it's like they keep going after a situation. I don't know. It's like they're a follower. They could be a coward even. Or this person may have a record. A criminal background. We all got a criminal background, don't we? I mean, I, I've been in jail <laughs> like three times. <laughs> but it wasn't for nothing like wild like that. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm just letting y'all look, letting y'all in on a little tea. It ain't nothing like serious but that I that I went to jail for. But anyway, yeah, somebody has a criminal and they miss opportunity. This is somebody that's very rude and tactless. It's like with to their kids, they'll be good, but to everybody else now, like I'm not gonna be good to no. Or they're gonna make you believe, like, I don't know. Like it's just something with this, man. Maybe somebody's childish or or whatever. This person could be out of control and it's like they want to just bombard in and, and like disrupt people's plans. Like for some of you, give me more on this knight of, I mean, this knight of swords with the queen of cups, please. Let's get a little bit more clarity on this person. Oh, child. Five of cups. Okay, so I don't know if this, I don't want to take that on the floor. Give me this, uh. Queen of Cups, Nine of Swords in reverse for Libra. Okay, we got the Five of Pentacles. Oh, yeah, this is why. This person's trying to do everything they can so they won't end up in poverty. But with the Five of Pentacles coming out here, this is someone that, oh, what I'm hearing, y'all. This somebody that that's losing their mind. They found out that they sick. This is a crazy. My Nine of Swords in reverse is a crazy person. This somebody that's losing their mind. They found out that they sick. They like what? What you mean I'm sick? Woo! They got it from their boyfriend. Yeah, we got the cherry here. Yeah, they confused. Like what? Seven of Cups. What you mean? What's the Five of Pentacles? Or this could be like somebody going through some money issues here. They're struggling behind the scenes. Yeah. So somebody has been left or they've been ghosted. Yeah. Okay. Five of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, Nine of Swords in reverse. Yeah, we got the Two of Swords. They're stuck between a rock and a hard place, trying to make a decision, sitting on a fence here. Yeah, because, yeah, Seven of Swords. I feel like this individual could have been doing some sneaky shit here. Well, this could have been, well, we got relationship, commitment, partner, boyfriend, girlfriend. So, Libra, whoever we're talking about, somebody, this person that, your ex or whoever, they got in a, in a situation here. It's like a, sl a snake got with a snake here. Whoever this third party is, they were cheating on this other person. I feel like this could be, um, okay, so let me calm down. Whoever this is, they was cheating on their person. They don't know who they got sick from. Okay, so they could be at a stalemate right now. They could be in a five of pentacles. I don't know if this person is like sick. If I get some more cards clarifying it, then like, but we already got the ten of wands over here. So, you know, either this could be this person going through, you know, some type of money struggles here at this time from doing something tactless and rude or this person could be sick. Now. There's another energy over here that's intimidated and jealous of you here. And it seemed like this is a mask. Oh, yeah, we got the king to the queen of pentacles. So there's like two people over here. Somebody could be addicted and obsessed with you here. But at the same time, it's like they're in love with you and then they hate you because you're a star and somebody wants to come in. They want to do something wicked, man. Then we have another energy over here that could be pregnant, that could be going through some type of hardships when in regards to a pregnancy. It's just so much that I'm getting off of this, these, these energies right now. It's so much. But this person doesn't want the baby. Somehow, I feel like this person was tied to this person. I feel like they all coincide together. Whoever this masculine is, they were dealing with this feminine and then this feminine, but they got this feminine pregnant, okay? And this feminine, you may know this person, okay? 
because we got the three of cups, which to me is more so like friendships, two parties, groups, um, that can mean like celebrations, baby showers, weddings. Um, well, I use the four of wands as weddings, communities, and things like that. But I'm really, really feeling like this is like some circle shit. Like, I don't know why I'm picking up. I don't know if this make any sense. Hopefully it do. But what's going on with this Queen of Swords, the Empress? What's going on with them? Yeah, this is giving me somebody that's pregnant, though. Like, they're very cold. Okay. Give me more of this. Um, the Emperor, the Tower, and then a Three of Swords. Yeah, a third party. So, for some of you, if this isn't this person, this could be you over here. Because I'm pulling the emperor. This could be your counterpart. That could be struggling right now. Or maybe like you just you just got your guard up here. You got a lot of responsibility here. Maybe you could be telling this person it. Okay. Now this could or this could be a baby mother, baby father figure here. That's what I'm saying. This could be a baby mama, baby daddy type of ordeal. To the point where there's something happening here. There's a tower. The tower came right by. Destruction came right with this emperor. So you could be dealing with a Sagittarius, a Libra, a Taurus, Aquarius, Gemini, Aries, Scorpio, Leo, Cancer. Yeah, a Taurus, Sagittarius. Yeah, those are signs that I'm seeing. A Capricorn. Um, yeah, so those are signs I'm seeing. So, yeah, three of swords, heartbreak, pain. Ooh-wee, somebody did something here. Good news. And then a lover's. For some of you, somebody was sleeping with the earth sign that was way younger than them. Page of swords and the will of fortune. But there's been a shakeup over there in that situation. There's been a breakup. There's been a disaster or something was a, some type of chaos in a third party dynamic here. Libra, I feel like. <laughs> What's Libra's energy? Give me my Libra's energy here. Yeah, this is your energy. You you chilling. Four of Wands. Or this could be like you just happy at home or whatever. I look at the four of wands like you happy at home. Like you just see yeah, a seven of wands. You standing up for yourself or you're protected here. Seven of wands or whatever this is. I feel like you could be building here. This could be like your foundation. Your foundation is protected. You don't have nothing to worry about. All right. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm just seeing that somebody going through a lot here right now. Yeah, you got the hermit too on the bottom of the deck. Yeah, okay, so the nine of pentacles. There you go. You want to show up. Hermit, nine of pentacles. You ain't seeing shit. You ain't bothering nobody. You chilling. And I feel like there's just, yeah, let's just keep going. Give me more on this uh, king of cups, please. Let's see. I'm going to have to pull out another deck. Yep, the king of cups is the high priestess. So secrets. Knowing something here, intuition. I feel like this King of Cups is using their intuition. Or this just could just be your spirit guides. Yeah. Or this, whoever this King of Cups is, they're using their intuition. Somebody tapping in like, man, I know y'all hating on my, like, I know y'all, y'all hating on my bitch. Like, or something like that. Like, I know y'all are some haters, bro. Like, I already know what's going on. Give me more on this King of Cups. Who is they? Who are they? Yeah, the Nine of Pentacles. Okay. So, this King of Cups knows that you're independent. Maybe somebody told them that you were a user or, or something like that. But whoever this is, they know you're independent. Some of y'all could be just like... Very quiet, very unbothered here. Um, it seems like this person could be just thinking about you with the two of wands. They could be have faced with the decision. Okay, give me more on this King of Cups, High Priestess, Nine of Pentacles. Give me more information. Yeah, new love, success, abundance in all areas. Somebody knows that you're going to get, yeah, you're moving on. Somebody knows that you're transitioning. You're moving on into a partnership or you're about to here. That's your justice. Yep. Justice was right there in between that. 
So that's your justice. Good karma. Also, this person, this King of Cups knows you're their good karma. Over here is chaos. Over here is chaos and craziness. So it's like somebody's surrounded by nothing but crazy shit. Maybe this person didn't know what they wanted. And now they could be seeing life differently now. Duh. La la. They seeing life differently now. So I feel like somebody's going through an they're they're going through an awakening or they're having an epiphany right now when it comes to you. But I feel like you're just yeah, I feel like you're gonna stay single. Yeah, we got the temperance. Yep. <laughs> Forgiveness, reconciliation, or just peace. I feel like you're gonna be focused more on peace here. You have this inner calm about you. Um, serenity. All right. Somebody wants to uh, accommodate you they want to um they want a harmonious balanced relationship with you or they feel like you are the harmonious one you you just balance them out on all levels my mind yeah somebody's in their mind or you know what i mean yeah ace of cups wow for some of you you're about to have a new beginning in love okay and this new beginning in love is you're going to get pregnant. You think you ain't going to get pregnant. You're going to be pregnant. You're going to be like, look at this. I'm pregnant. Or for some of you, they're going to try to trap you with a child. Ooh. Wrap it up. Yeah. Okay. And for others of you, you closed out a cycle between this person because it was too karmic. All right. This is like you accomplishing something here. For some of you. You're going to be expanding your horizons or you're just going to be adding more to, you know, your family or whatever. Just, you're going to just be adding more. Everything is going to be looking on the up and ups for you here. Yeah, we got the sun, the ace of wands, a new passionate beginning. Ooh. All right, let's close it down for Libra. What else do we have in closing for Libra, please? Spirit guides, ancestors, nine of swords. Wow. And this landed right over here. This person is worried shitless, man. And they're burning. I feel like this this emperor is at their breaking point with this tower moment, dog. Like, they going through a lot of regret right now. And it's like this person keeps focusing on the shit that they did in the past. But just apologize, admit to what you did, yeah, nine, nine, yeah, completion. For some of you, this person was a user and they wanted to probably try to like, they were very materialistic or maybe they feel like you wasn't going to give them what they wanted or whatever this is. And maybe they found wish fulfillment and using people and mooching off people. But I feel like this individual got a crazy ass bitch on their hands. Okay, Libra. They need to be worried about this crazy person and whoever this is, they got this pregnancy by or or whatever. It's just a lot. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling like it's a lot of drama. It's a lot of drama. What's the nine of swords? This person can't eat. They can't sleep. They're unhappy. They're going through a lot of stress. They're overwhelmed. It could be in a work situation. It could just be with life. They have an inability to cope with the certain situations that they created because they know they need to tell you the truth. Yeah, we got the death. Somebody's scared of, of ending or they're scared of this change or somebody's scared of dying. Damn. somebody's worried about this change man or they're worried if you change bad little vibe if somebody has bad vibes what is this nine of swords for some of you they're going to get communication about somebody passing what's the nine of swords and a death yeah something is going there's communication coming in here something is going to be revealed to this masculine here i'm getting a lot of communication or they're going to see emails here i'm seeing eyes looking in looking at messages here about spell work that someone has did yeah candle magic page of wands yeah and a group of people here collaborating with each other here Oh, they was working together. Wow. Y'all need to see what I'm seeing right now. The sun, the eight of wands, the magician. I'm seeing, yeah, somebody's looking at messages. And in these messages, they're talking about like binding someone to them here and doing candle magic. And it's like, this could be like a group message or like a group of people that did this. Let me get up out this energy. <laughs> For some of you, they could be worried about legal matters here with this on the bottom of the deck. And they're trying to encounter you. Faded meeting for healing or this person needs 
healing, okay? Somebody may be coming to you for healing, Libra, or your healing energy, or maybe like they need help, okay? Because I feel like this person, I'm hearing something about a near-death experience here as well. Yeah, I'm seeing a death with the three of swords. So something that has to do with the heart or chest pains. Okay. Let's get... Okay, so let's finish this reading. In my ideal world, we are so happy together. Yeah, this person fantasizes and dreams about you um, being, being together, buying a house, getting married. Um... You know, just having it all. I admire you for being so bold, brave in your life. And I'm heartbroken since I realized how much I hurt you. Yeah, for some of you, this person is... Okay, so I, to what I'm getting, everything that this person has did to you is also being done to them. But it's like 10,000 times worse, right? But at the same time, this is like a type of hurt that would... Try, like, you know, because you know you can die from a broken heart. You know that, right? This person is being broken down so much to the point where it's hurting them. Like, they are literally in pain. Remember, in the beginning, I was like, I got chest pains. Like, what's going on? Like, do y'all have chest pains? So, somebody is literally in physical pain from, I feel like this is like repetitive over and over again. Somebody keeps thinking like, damn, like I did that. And then there go another minute. Oh, damn, I did that. Like, somebody's seeing what they did and this is a tower nine of swords death three of swords all right there together but they're saying i do love you from the bottom of my heart and i will never stop so this person is never going to give up they ain't gonna ever give up either i still have hope that we will be together again come on man I just said they never going to give up. For some of you, you were the catalyst to this person's awakening. So what you should be doing right now, you should, you should be patting yourself on your back. Job well done. That's what you did. You did that. It's not possible to lose each other. We are forever connected. Yeah, this could be your counterpart. That's saying, yeah, I'm sorry for breaking promises that i've made to you yeah this person promised you a lot and they broke it but this is the lesson libra that this person has to learn okay i feel like you're just peaceful you're balanced you're meditating and there's you know so i'm gonna leave it there libra uh, hopefully this message resonates to someone Okay, um, do me a favor, like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on. Damn, my kids finna get out of school. I'm about to go, um, okay. Take care, Libra. Bye.